Hello everyone, we're happy that you're watching us. Today we're going to tell you about the Sea Wolf, a class of nuclear-powered fast attack submarines in service with the United States Navy. The class was intended as a successor to the Los Angeles class, and design work would begin in 1983. A fleet of 29 submarines was to be built over a 10-year period, but that would be reduced to 12. The end of the Cold War and budget constraints led to the cancellation of any further additions to the fleet in 1995, leaving the Sea Wolf class limited to just three boats. This in turn led to the design of smaller Virginia class. The Sea Wolf class cost about $3 billion per unit, making it the most expensive SSN submarine and second most expensive submarine ever after the French SSBN Triumphant class. Of its design, the Sea Wolf was intended to be a combat threat of advanced Soviet ballistic missile submarines such as the Typhoon class and attack submarines like the Akula class in a deep ocean environment. Sea Wolf class hulls are constructed from HY-100 steel, which is stronger than the HY-80 steel employed in previous classes in order to withstand water pressure at greater depths. Sea Wolf submarines are larger, faster, and significantly quieter than previous Los Angeles class submarines and also carry more weapons having twice as many torpedo tubes. The boats are able to carry up to 50 UGM-109 Tomahawk cruise missiles for attacking land and sea surface targets. The boats also have extensive equipment to allow shallow water operations. This class uses the more advanced ARCI modified AN BSY-2 combat system, which includes a larger spherical sonar array, a wide aperture array, a new towed array sonar, and each boat is powered by a single S6W nuclear reactor, which delivers 45,000 horsepower to a low noise pump jet. As a result of their advanced design, however, Sea Wolf submarines were much more expensive. The projected cost for 12 submarines of this class was in the range of $33.6 billion, but construction was stopped at three boats when the Cold War ended. When it comes to specifications, it features a displacement when surfaced of 8,600 tons. When submerged, it's 9,138 tons and 12,139 tons full. It features a length of 108 meters with a beam of 12 meters. When it comes to propulsion, it features one S6W power, 45,000 horsepower engine, one secondary propulsion submerged motor, one shaft, one pump jet propeller, which can reach speeds of 37 kilometers per hour silent and 65 kilometers per hour maximum. It has a test depth of 490 meters, a complement of 140, and of its crew it features 14 officers with 126 enlisted and an armament of 8 660 millimeter torpedo tubes. Did you like this video? Then let us know what you think about it in the comments below. Also be sure to subscribe to the channel to get more interesting updates from us in the future. Thanks for watching.